Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got different dimension, Queen Nefertiti, and I'm going to do some double stamping. I have started off with Miltique's Formula 2, and here is different dimension, Queen Nefertiti. This was out of the last hollow hookup box, and I also topped it off with some Posh Top Coat. It is bling-tastic. Today, I'll be stamping with Bundle Monster 721 and Bundle Monster 220 my monocle stamper and my Faber nail scraper and this is pure ice silver Mercedes and born pretty stamping polish in gold I'm gonna go in and do a French tip design on most of my nails today and I'm gonna start doing the layering by doing the silver first and then clean off that plate so that we can do the gold next and it looks like Shazam there's no gold but there is there's still some gold on there and I'm gonna layer that over the silver and I think this just kind of gave it more of an antique effect depending on how the light hit it sometimes it looks silver sometimes it looks gold and this is going to be for my accent finger on my ring finger and I'm going to do the same layering process just using a different image a full image and there we go got the silver on there I did a little bit of cleanup and do it again with the gold and I did wear this manicure on its own you know just the base polish for a day or two before I decided to stamp over it um, I enjoyed it on its very own for a little bit. And here we go. We're going to clean that plate off and get it out of the way and bring the other plate back so that we can take care of this pinky nail. And the Silver Mercedes from Pure Ice is not a stamping polish, but it is one of my favorite polishes to use for stamping. And that image did not pick up so good, so we're going to go at it again. Here we go. Fingers crossed. Ta-da! Yes. There we go. And now for the gold topper. Gonna to top it off with some gold. I just wanted something a little different. I just, you know, sometimes I get in there and just start playing and, you know, it's just nail polish. If we don't like it, it's, it's all good comes off we can do something else but I actually ended up really liking this one and I'm gonna do some cleanup with some tape real quick but I really did like this one in person it was way prettier than the camera will show you and one of these days maybe I'll get this filming thing down and get the lighting right and you'll be able to see what I see so we're gonna top this one off with some posh top coat seal that stamp and design in and I did do the same manicure on both hands and at the end of the video I will show you swatch photos of both hands and I will try to keep this up for a little while I know it won't last because I'm a creature of habit and I do like having two different manicures <laughs> on each hand you know I like to have something on my left hand and something different on my right hand it's funny I, I never dreamed it but that here we are today and that's that's how I like it um, so we're capping the tips to make sure that this is a sealed in good to seal good sealed in design and I'm turn off some lights to see if we can get some up so you can see the stamping a little better it takes away from the blinginess of the base polish but uh, what are you gonna do here's what it looks like on my longer nails and then on my shorter nails so I hope you like this one. Leave me a comment down below. I always love to hear from you. Thanks for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.